What up, everybody? Power Book 4, Force, Season 2, Episode 4 is titled, The Devils in the Details. And the description reads, Tommy and Diamond keep dangerous secrets from each other. Jannar clashes with his crew. And Vic teams up with Claudia one last time. D-Mac ends up entangled deeper in the drug game than he ever intended. So today I'm talking about five things to look for on episode four, starting with Claudia's meeting with Mirkovic. These are two parties that could use some help because they've been taking nothing but L's all season so far. Claudia blew her life savings on Dahlia only for Tommy to have JP leak the recipe. She was given an opportunity in the Flynn organization only for it to be taken away and given to Vic. And Walter then cleaned out her safe and canceled all her credit cards. The Serbs, on the other hand, thought they were going to be getting their pipeline back, only for them to pull up and be greeted by CBI and a very unfriendly Tommy Egan. Then last episode, they just lost another pipeline through the prison system as Rojas was forced to buy his bricks from Diamond instead of the Serbs. The Serbs have basically been getting by living off Gennard so far this season. And now these two sides are considering a partnership. They also have a common enemy in Tommy Egan. So they could be coming together to discuss taking out Tommy. Last season, the Serbs and the Flins had a beef. But that was more or less something Walter used to take out Gloria. And once that was finished, he was quick to settle his beef with the Serbs. Now also keep in mind that Vic was furious about Walter making that decision. Because he initially wanted to wipe out all the Serbs for killing Gloria. Either though this was last season, on the Force timeline... It's only been around a month's time. I'm also expecting something major to happen within the Flynn organization within the next episode or two. Possibly the death of Vic Flynn. Episode 5 is called Crown Vic. And the actor who plays Vic was just on the Crew Has It podcast. And they sometimes have characters on around the time of their death. Plus there are no more scenes with Vic in the season two promos. A lot of people are expecting Claudia to die soon, but it won't be anytime soon because she still has a few clips left from the season two promos. And she has to get into a relationship with Brendan Doyle before anything happens to her. Walter, on the other hand, only has one scene left from the trailer where he is walking somewhere with a gun, looking like he's about to go to war. Get me to the next thing to look out for, and that is Rojas making a move on Diamond's girl, the CO, Kendra. After Rojas turned down the offer CBI sent through the lawyer, they decided to play hardball. And Kendra threatened to turn Rojas in for drug dealing if he didn't start working with Diamond. Rojas reluctantly agreed to avoid being sent to the hole. But what other option did he have at the time? Now that he knows who Diamond has in his pocket, Kendra could be in danger both on the inside and in the streets. Rojas will most likely try to have Kendra killed or might make a move to get her arrested. Next, I have Jannard make an example out of someone in his crew. I've talked about it a few times now from the Diamond vs. Jannard promo where Jannard snaps and is screaming with blood all up in his mouth. I think we are finally going to get to see this scene in the coming episode because it says Jannard clashes with his crew. The crazy thing is the episode 5 description says Jannard hits rock bottom on that episode. I don't know how it can get any worse for him after episode 3. But in addition to that, 
I'm also looking for Jannard to finally kill Mirkovic this episode. Now that Jannard is strung out, he's not going to put up with Mirkovic extorting money from him anymore and probably won't have any money to pay him either. I know that Jannard starts a beef with the Serbs from the Season 2 trailer and there is also a new Serb leader who comes into the picture at some point. So most likely, Jannard will kill Mirkovic before Claudia can get anything out of her partnership. Then she will turn to Brendan Doyle. The next thing to be on the lookout for is D-Mac jumping off the porch. The description says he gets entangled in the drug game deeper than he ever intended. This could mean he catches his first body and gets caught into the cycle Tariq was telling Effie about. It could also be that he ends up owing money to a dangerous drug dealer and forced to sell their product. And Tommy might have to end up killing that person to save D-Mac and getting himself into another beef in the process. There's also a chance that D-Mac gets arrested, but I don't think that's going to happen. Keep in mind that D-Mac and Marshall are only 16. That's why last season they wanted to become couriers for Jannard because they knew if they got busted, they wouldn't have to do any real time. Plus, D-Mac was raised up in the game, so like Lil' K, the cops aren't going to be able to manipulate him into being a snitch or anything like that. Getting me to the final thing to be on the lookout for, and that is Diamond and Tommy's secrets. In the episode 4 trailer, Tommy is pointing his gun at Diamond and asking what they do with snitches in Chicago. This could be in connection to the mystery unknown phone call Diamond has been getting. Most likely, whoever it is will make Tommy think that Diamond is a snitch. There's also a chance that Tommy isn't actually talking to Diamond, but the camera angle only makes it look that way, but he's actually talking to the person Diamond is with, possibly his girl Kendra, or maybe even Adrian. It could be after Rojas sets Kendra up, she starts talking and Tommy somehow finds out about it. As far as the secret Tommy is keeping, it is most likely that he's trying to smash Maria. And Diamond specifically told Tommy that Maria is off limits. And the graveyard is packed with guys who made the same mistake. Tommy messing with Maria could cause problems for Diamond with Miguel. Plus, Tommy got other secrets, like the fact he's a wanted criminal who faked his death. And there you have it, five things to look for. Force, episode 204, The Devils in the Details. Leave your thoughts, theories, and predictions in the comments.